Hi, uh, my name is Cheryl Jala. I'm the Council Representative for International Development Law Organization, ICLO. Um, it's an intergovernmental agency that is based in Rome. Um, and uh, the, the basic law program, country program in Somalia, our mandate is to help advance the constitution process. So we work with the Prime Minister's Office and also with the uh, Minister of Constitutional Affairs and uh, Conservation. Uh, actually, this is a very targeted um, consultation. The consultation is, is on purely on ending the transition. And what we have actually brought together the first time, as the Minister was saying earlier in Somali, in his introduction, you know, the most prominent Somalis who, are, who live in Nairobi and also outside. So we have former Prime Ministers, we have Ministers, we also have you know, very well respected uh, you know, business people and, and, and religious elders, and also women, women groups. So it's a very good sample, if you like, of, of the Somali community. And the idea primarily is to discuss the ending, the ending of transition. So as you know, that the mandate of the current, current transition of the federal government will end in August 2020, 2012. Um, so what has been uh, charted out is a political roadmap. So the roadmap basically charts, uh, sort of outlines the steps and what needs to happen. There are certain issues that need to be ironed out. Um, the minister who has invited the participants and we have facilitated wanted to basically explain where the process is and also get the feedback from, from all these Somali you know, people. The idea is that's why when you look at the participants, these are individuals you know, who are the opinion makers in Somalia. So the, their views will be captured in the ending of the transition. So the plan that the government actually has will the need be, if, if you know, whatever comes out here, will, will take into consideration. So for example, how the selection of the transition, uh, the transition that is going to take place. That is something a lot of people, a lot of Somalis have been talking about. So, Whatever suggestion that comes out here, hopefully the government, that's what the minister said, they will take into account, so it will be incorporated with their, with their policy decisions.